long-term results. This is five years. Five years. Okay. Look at the tissue. Look at the look at the the, the material. Look at everything. Five years. Okay. This is nine years. This is C1 on a gray-haired lady. Okay. She was she was like a C3. So I brought her up to a C1. This is nine years post-op. This is 10 years post-op. 10 years on a mutilated dentition. This is two years, same person now. Five years, nine years. This is 10 years, I think. Yeah, 10 years on a diastema closure. This was a hygienist of mine. 10 years on a diastema closure. This is eight years on four teeth against the rest of them. Eight years. Now watch. She comes back at eight years, and there's, I, I had to repair this, this area right here. You can see that. And there's a little repair I have to need to do here, but they're easy to do, okay? That's eight years. Now, I don't see her until 19 years. And at, the colors change because I, the others were taking an analog. And that's why sometimes you see a discrepancy because I a lot of the slides, earlier slides were analog. And, uh, um, and now she comes back to me at 19 years, let's see, 19 years, and she's got, an, she had orthodontics, so she wanted this fixed. I said, well, I can repair that, and I can repair this. She says, no, she says, I think I want a wider color now. So that's what we did. So we did redid her after 19 years. She wanted a wider color, so we gave her a lighter color, okay? 19 years, 18 months post-op, we bleached her. It was all right. That's 18 months post-op. This is two years. I said, why don't we re-bleach, re okay? So this is two years. Now, now that's 21 years. You see what I'm saying? 21 years, okay, and I did the, and I re-bleached her, and we got a really good color match with the re-bleaching. So she ended up with lighter teeth, it was my patient, she was 19 years in the old ones, and, and now she's two, two years here in the new ones. Now we'll show you grafting. This is, I mean, I'll tell you, this, this is why if you can do it interdisciplinary, that's the way to do it. This is a Polaroid uh, of a, a patient. This patient comes back. I did at five and a half years, okay? That's the way she started. This is the way she finished at five and a half years. But let's look at the case. All right? When I did this case, she had four teeth I had to do. But the mother asked me, would you... Uh, Six sister. I said, no way. I said, you need to have that grafted. She wouldn't do it. I said, well, I'm not doing it. Okay. So she comes back. Right. Now she comes back at, 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 and at six, at five and a half years. Okay. And she's got recession on the other side. She said, can you fix that? I said, no. I said, you're going to have grafting. Okay. So I sent her to my guy, all right? And this is what he did. That's three months. That's a year. That's grafting, okay? So let's go the other side. Same thing, three months and a year. And now we look at it. And that's my veneers, now are six and a half years old. Look at them. 
like the day I did them. And yet, now look at what with the graphing, how beautiful that is. That's why, you know, I you I sent people out to to work on to to make the smile the best I could. And that's that's what uh, this whole thing is all about for me. Thank you.